Is it the magic pill we've been waiting for? Could a humble plant hold the secret to saving a stroke victim or curing cancer? It's the holy grail of modern medicine, and the quest to find it is underway among the ancient arts of Chinese herbalism here in the health science laboratories at RMIT. For many Westerners, Chinese medicine is a mystery. To the skeptics, unknown and unproven. But that's changing. In Australia, alternative medicine has become a $2 billion business. And headed by Professor Charlie Zhu, RMIT's Chinese Medicine Unit is a major player in Australia and worldwide. Western medicine still has no effective treatment for stroke. But this plant, Dan Shen, has been used successfully in China for thousands of years. And here in its world-class laboratories, the RMIT team is discovering why. The researchers have already isolated Dan Shen's active ingredient. It's an ingenious compound called Tanchinone 2A. Tanchinone 2A attacks irregularly growing cells, including cancer. But unlike conventional cancer-treating compounds, it launches a multi-pronged attack. It poisons malfunctioning cells. It programs their ultimate death. And it cleverly protects healthy cells around them. In China, clinical trials for Tanchinone 2A as a stroke treatment are already underway. The results are promising indeed. It's the tip of a very lucrative iceberg. Internationally, the hunt is on for natural medicines hidden away in Chinese herbs. The US government is investing more than a billion dollars in the rush for natural pharmaceuticals. Big business is spending more. Already seven million has been invested in Chinese medicine research at RMIT. And the results are paying off. It's a bold new RMIT initiative that may well revolutionize treatment for cancer, stroke, diabetes, and a host of medical ailments for which, until now, conventional cures have been ineffective. 